guys, what's going on? It's Teddy B with VaporBeast.com and today I'm proud to talk to you about the newest addition to our mechanical mod family. We have the Stingray X clone by Segreen. There you have your Stingray X mod. It's in 18650 mode. It also comes with a wide bore drip tip and a hybrid adapter so you can put your RDAs on there. Now let's all take all this stuff out the box and show you what it all looks like. All right, guys. So here you go. This is the awesome Stingray X. Now right now it's in 18650 mode, but if you're a person who likes to vape with stealth mode, you just remove one of these extension tubes and you're able to put your 18350 battery in there. Or if you wanted to go 18500, you just take off another extension tube, add the other one on there, put it on, and voila, you can vape in 18500 mode. Me personally, I love to vape in 18650 mode. You just get a whole lot longer uh, vaping time with those uh, high drain batteries. Also, what you get with this nice, awesome little package is a wide bore drip tip that you can put onto any type of a tank or RDA that you're using. It has a 510 O-ring, so it's pretty much going to be able to fit with the majority of like your Igo W's, or if you like to use the Patriot or Nimbus, or if you're like myself and you love the Mephesto, you can definitely put it with that as well. Also, what you're going to be getting in this nice little package is this little disc right here. Now, you might be wondering, Teddy, what is this? Well, what this disc here is a hybrid adapter. And what it's meant for is to be used with your RDAs, so when you put it on, it'll sit there nice and flush. Now, originally, when you get your mod, you'll notice this 510 connection right here. The 510 connection right here, this is going to be more geared for if you're going to be using tanks, or maybe like an RTA, or if you're not really worried about um, your RDA or whatever you're using sitting flush on the mod. So let's show you guys how to put this hybrid adapter on and get this rocking and rolling for you. So when you're ready to get your RDA set on on your new Stingray X and you want to use your hybrid adapter, the very first thing you're going to want to do is take your hybrid adapter, take your RDA, and screw the hybrid adapter onto the RDA first. Do not, I repeat, do not put the hybrid adapter on before you put your RDA on there. So you have it on. Now what you're going to want to do is put this adapter onto your mod. Now initially when you're looking at it, you'll notice that you really don't have a lot of room to put the adapter on there. What you're going to want to do is go ahead and just unscrew the button out slightly so. So you start getting a little playroom so you can put the adapter into the mod. There's some inside threading right here and outside threading so it's going to be very easy to screw this into your mod. So let's just get that screwed in real quick. See how pretty it is? I got the Vapor Forge RDA sitting nice and flush with my Stingray X. Ugh, what a beauty. What a beauty. Now let's give her a vape and see how everything's working with it. Out of sight. I absolutely love this mod. This is a really great mod. Uh, the Stingray X is definitely going to be a new part of my collection. If you have any questions, feel free to give us a call. Toll free, 877-821-6062. And a vape tech will be able to assist you with your questions. This is Teddy B with VaporBeast.com telling you to keep it beast.